Yeah, hi there. These comments are for uh, KL, and I am Michael, the founder, owner, and the materials writer for all of your lessons at the 7-Step System to Pass a TOEFL IBT. I'm in my office right now. It's freezing cold. I don't know why. So I have my jacket on. And you completed uh, Integrated Speaking Practice Test number 16. So thank you for doing the assignment. And let's get started. Let's see how you did. In the listening passage, the speaker talked about the formation of glaciers. First, glaciers began to form from near around snow mountain where enough snow accumulate to transform into ice. Okay, good. I like your introduction. I would just say the speaker talks or discusses about the formation of glaciers and just use present tense verbs. The new layers of snow compress the previous layers every year. It makes the snow to recrystallize. I would say which, not it, which makes or causes the snow to recrystallize. Then, with the grains grow larger and the air pockets between grains get smaller, snow begin to slowly compact and increase in density. Good. And after two winters, the snow turns into fern. With time. Large. And fern is that intermediate state between snow and glacial ice. I would define that for your audience. Ice crystals become compressed and air pockets between them are tiny. After a hundred years, for most glaciers, they become so heavy and began to move downhill because of the force of gravity. Yeah, okay, good. All right, let's take a look at this one. So I, I think you had some slight problems with language use on this one. Also with your delivery, your delivery's not perfect so sometimes you have some minor issues with pacing and pausing. So what that's telling me is you're having a little bit more trouble when you're discussing technical or academic <laughs> type information. So you have to, uh, you're not quite comfortable with a lot of the terminology and the things that you were speaking about so it was a little bit harder for you there uh, so some minor problems with delivery um, <coughs> I'm going to put you at about 2.5 out of 4 on this one 19 points out of 30 on this particular practice test alright now for the purposes of our class if you go into the syllabus uh, 2.5 is going to put you at 85% on this particular project. Alright, so that's where I would put you with this one. Okay, thank you for completing the assignment and, and very good work. You worked hard this quarter so far, so keep up the good work. 